So, Katarina, what are we doing? What are we putting on right now? Well, first step is we just cleansed your face with a bit of micellar water because you've had a shower and everything, but just to yeah. freshen up. Now I'm just using the Pixie glycolic acid mm. um, just to take off those top layers of dead skin to make sure that all the products that we're going to put on after will penetrate as deep as we can into the skin. So that just gives you a good brighten up there. It does look bright. Mm. So this is what we're using, the Pixie Glow Tonic, and um, yeah, just there. So right. next step is a green tea water bomb, which has green tea essence in it and hyaluronic acid. So that's going to just put some moisture back into the skin, and the green tea is a great antioxidant, just like vitamin C. Oh, okay. Yes, so they're in the same class as antioxidants, but there's new research showing that green tea combined with red light therapy enhances the results of red light therapy wow so green tea mm -hmm. with red light therapy gives you better results than better anti-aging results yes wow so what we do is we just let that dry off for a moment or two mm -hmm. and then we'll do the red light mask on you oh and we're using the um the just current, current body one. Current body. So there's uh, the current body, and current body also do a neck and, and neck chest and chest section. So you could buy it as a, like a, a set. Two, a set. Oh, yes, but okay. I bought I bought this one before they came out with the neck and chest. So and, uh, I've got this because one. you're so, you're super like clued up about all this. Stuff. <laughs> I'm so impressed. So I'm just sort of pressing it in mm -hmm. because you know what what the whole press the skin press the essence into the skin oh, Korean that, method. Oh, oh, okay. Yes, yes. So sometimes, especially if it, well, it doesn't happen much here in Singapore, but there are two instances really. If it's really, really, really cold, you can do what they call the seven-step method and do this seven times. So put essence in your hand yep. and press it in your face and do that seven times so okay. that you're slowly just building up those layers of not moisture, hydration. Hydration. Which oh, is so a you different... literally do this step yeah, seven times. Seven times. Wow. Okay. What I find in Singapore is this is actually helpful because you do get dehydrated here because of all the air conditioning that you're in most of the time. Yeah. And sometimes the moisturizer can be too heavy for you. But if you do the seven step, I mean, you can do four step, five step, but it's called seven step if you want yeah. to go that far. If you do that, you're actually pressing in those moist uh, levels of hydration like that okay. into your skin. Right. And it gives you a nice plumping, hydrating effect to your skin without being heavily moisturized. Okay. Can you feel that? I feel, yeah, like it feels like nothing. Mm. But your skin feels but plump yes. and moisturized, not yes. tight. No, 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 not tight at all. Okay. That's lovely. Excellent. Uh, yeah. And now the piece de resistance. Mm. Let me line you up. Okay, sorry, I've got to undo that. This is a treat, guys. <laughs> like I, I am just loving the fact that I've got this Adam <laughs> spa going on. <laughs> All right, there we go. We'll take it around the back, mm -hmm. and I've got to put it in this section here. Now, I just want to be careful because you've got a lovely long hair that I don't catch onto your hair okay. too much. Sorry, right, love. That's all right, that's all right. Are we on? Yes. All right, put your head back, and it okay. will keep it on. Okay. All right, there you go. You're yeah. on. And now? I look better now. There we go. Yeah. Oh, now. <gasps> look at that. Oh, my God. So that's got the infrared and red light, which is all about collagen and elastin synthesis in your skin. Okay, and that's okay. what we want. Elastin. And collagen and synthesis. And collagen synthesis. Mm -hmm. Well, you need to explain that a little bit more. Uh, basically, as you, you know, as a young person, what keeps your skin nice and tight and taut and wrinkle-free is the amount of collagen you've got <laughs> in your skin. And as you get older, from, from probably your middle 30s, yeah. you're producing less and less collagen. Oh, okay. So, um, yeah. so what you want to do is you want to find ways of encouraging your skin to create more collagen okay. and red light therapy has been clinically proven yep. to help with increasing collagen levels in your skin. Wow. Okay. okay. So red light therapy, mm -hmm. ladies, 
is and mixed with green tea with green tea it enhances the results enhances the you results. still get great results with red light but yeah. what the heck if you can do a you know a quick quick step with a green tea toner beforehand there's no you know it's not a huge step to incorporate in your routine okay right that's that's great Ooh. i'm just gonna take a photo okay right. now we're just going to pop on a vitamin c serum i'm just going to press that in we all know vitamin c is all about antioxidants um, helping to break down some melasma or dark spots you may have on your face mm. um, and also over 20 percent yeah is actually been proven of l ascorbic acid has actually been proven to again impact collagen synthesis wow so okay. as you get older it's all about the collagen how do we keep building that collagen layer in the skin right Yes, exactly. Yes. So keep... either by topical applications or whether it's, you know, if you go to the dermatologist and you get radio frequency or you get all therapy, which is ultrasound, it's all about stimulating collagen synthesis. Okay. So this is one simple way at home that you can attack those three issues with, um, with a vitamin C. So okay. clarity, antioxidants, so breaking down those free radicals on your skin and also um, collagen synthesis as well. Okay guys you heard that ladies so three three factors why you want you want to use vitamin c collagen um removing the free radicals and also for clarity so yeah and this should be done on a daily basis daily in the morning in the morning yes because vitamin c also um works hand in hand with sunscreen so a lot of yeah. korean sunscreens or japanese sunscreens actually include vitamin c in the sunscreen okay um, so well. should you go in the sun with it or, or oh yes you can go in the sun with it in fact it enhances the um, properties of your sunscreen if you do use vitamin c so okay. going in the sun is not a problem with vitamin c okay and should you like i know some people they put foil over their vitamin c to yeah. stop it from oxidizing and things yeah. like that is yeah. that necessary it is it is it, it does l score if you look at vitamin c and let's yeah. try and keep it simple yeah there's vitamin c which is l which a form of vitamin C, pure, is yeah. L-ascorbic acid. Okay. Um, there are other forms of vitamin C which are derivatives, say THD or ethylated ascorbic acid. Wow, so there's different the formulas. Yes. Names I have not even but heard of. Right. Those are much more stable. Oh, I if see. If your one is yeah. L-ascorbic acid, it breaks down quite easily. And this one already has a little bit of a yellow colouring to it. But right. if it starts to look sort of really amber, orange looking, then it's gone off. Then it's gone off. So, okay. yeah, keeping it foiled up in the fridge will prolong the life. But usually a bottle like this, within three months, it should be gone. You should not be using it after three months. Okay, so three um, months for a bottle this size. Yeah. And preferably to um, cover it with foil mm -hmm. or something, keeping it in the fridge. Mm -hmm. As soon as you see the uh the color change into more of an orangey amber shade then that means that the properties are not going to work anymore yeah. like it's just not effective yeah um and a better more stable component of um version of version vitamin c, of vitamin c was the thd thd or ethylated ascorbic acid or ethylated ascorbic acid and there are products on the market that have those form forms of vitamin c in it right but today i just bought this one which is the wish trend um and i think here in singapore i, I think it's available in guardian look guardian or watson i always get get it muddled up between the two okay but one of those um sells the wish trend wish and this trend. is 21.5 percent. that's quite a good percentage right yeah and is it stinging or anything no no good no excellent yeah it's okay. a very nice formulation cool it's going to i've put a few drops on the back of my hand and i'll show you what it is okay the Next eye. step, hold it up. It's the Good Molecules Wake Up Eye Serum, and um, Good Molecules is the in-house brand of Beautylish. Their products are actually made in Korea, are very reasonably priced. If I look, I can't remember exactly, but it's this bottle is somewhere between seven and twelve USD. Um, oh, it's very affordable. Yeah, and I buy it off the Beautylish site. Okay, and I think if I remember correctly, it's something like. If you buy over $75 Singapore, it's free shipping and it's literally sort of three, four days shipping. Oh, Beautylish then everyone. Yeah, okay. Beautylish.com. If anyone is into Wayne Goss, they I, all... <laughs> I, I love him. They sell his brushes and makeup as okay. well. So okay. you can maybe treat yourself with an, uh, Wayne Goss eye palette 
and a Good Molecules eye serum at okay, the same time. at the same time. Yeah. Absolutely. Now, good Molecules also have, and, and I've got nothing to do with Good Molecules, I, you know, this is all purchased on my own, etc. Yes. Um, but they also have quite a range of other products. They've got a pineapple enzymatic um, face wash. Sounds they've got a nice cinnamide serum. Oh, I they've love got, niacinamide. Yeah. yeah, and they've got a vitamin C pure l ascorbic acid um, powder. Oh, as well. Oh, so you can mix, so you mix that it in, in with yes. water. So that's probably not more... with water. Oh no, no, you uh, water water um, water uh, makes the vitamin C degrade quicker. So, oh, so you need oil. Uh, you would mix it in with an oil. You could put it into your moisturizer. Oh wow. Okay. Yes. That's yes. really interesting. Yes. And a powder that you can yes. mix in. So Just, good okay. molecules have got it, molecules. and also uh, the ordinary have also brought out a vitamin C powder okay. as well. Okay. okay. All right. All right. So we're on to which step? On to now is like it's all about hydration. Hydration. So if you think about hydration, is um, actually getting water, water, and hydration into the layers of your skin, whereas moisturization is actually just sealing off whatever you've done to your skin to make sure that you don't get that transdermal water loss. Ah, uh, okay. Right. So here I have one of my favorite serums. It's the Huxley. And you can see that. Secret of Sahara. There you go. Of course. Right. Okay. Yes. So that's just a very nice, beautiful hydrating serum. And then what I like to add, I like to cocktail a bit. This is the COSRX. Um, B5, the panathoic acid, um, and this is all about your skin barrier. So skin barrier is very, very important in maintaining healthy skin function. Okay. So then I will take and just put maybe one, two drops of that in with the essence. Okay. Mix that all up. And again, let's do the pressing. Well, smoothing for a moment. <laughs> <laughs> and I take everything over the eyes as well. Okay. This, I, I do that as well, actually. Yeah. I, um, yeah. I know a lot of people say that you don't have to, um, that you should have an eye cream for the eye, and then. but I just, I've never really done that. No, I, I pretty much think if I can... Put it on use, my face, I can put it on my yeah, eyes, right? Yeah. yeah. I mean, I did use the caffeine serum, only mm. because that has specifically caffeine right, in it. Right, right, yes. I do which have, helps yes. with sort of depuffing and getting... I do skin. have, like, eye cream as such, but I still, like, if I'm using a night cream or anything, I will not not yeah. put it on my eyes yes yeah. exactly okay so then we put that in and you can see see how it, if there's a little bit of bounce happening yeah, yeah there's so a bit of tack the, yeah and your skin's a bit bouncy as well now so we've really addressed that just putting hydration back into the skin mm. at, without using heavy moisturizers or occlusives at this point i can i mean i mean definitely my skin is looking brighter already i can see it and then like the luminosity mm. right mm. you can just see that radiance coming yeah. which is nice and it just still doesn't feel heavy at all no exactly no that's the whole point yeah it's that whole you know the korean chok chok as they call it the chok chok skin the chok chok yes. is, is it this it's the bouncy chok chok the bouncy <laughs> uh. <laughs> i've got chok chok you've got chok chok but without you know putting really heavy 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 creams in mm. there and just making sure that you've exfoliated enough so that you can press that hydration into the skin and your skin can take it up okay wow look at that it really doesn't feel heavy at all it just literally it's like it's just sunken in mm. like mm. there's no, no yeah there's no residue no not at all and then of course because it's a special spa day <laughs> but if you're like me you'll wear one of these when you're cooking dinner of course let me just get this happening. I'm opening up a face mask. Oh, okay, a face mask. mask, a paper one. Yeah. yeah. And just let me work it out because it's like a bit of origami here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting there. I'm really liking, I mean, I can just see it. I mean, I, thought, I think you guys will be able to see just how it honestly does not feel oily at all. Like, like I've got my thing on. Okay, sheet mask time. This one mm. has a lot of essence in it. So, you know, the secret is if you're doing this at home on your own and you've got a lot of essence, put it all the way down your chest, neck, your neck arms, hands. Mm. Don't waste Don't that waste essence. It. Sorry, love. Don't waste it one little bit. All right. So we'll leave that on maybe 20 minutes okay. or so. I'll show you which one it is. It's just the AHC 
Sika complex, Sika 3 complex. So Sika mm. again is all about healthy skin barrier function. If you've got a healthy barrier, you're not going to be losing moisture from your skin. You, your skin barrier is actually going to be a protective layer, which is what it's supposed to be. That's the function of a skin barrier. Okay. It's to protect your skin. Yes. And so um, if people, exfoliation is important. So people might exfoliate and then put a heavy moisturizer on. That's not addressing hydration. Okay. Okay. So that's just putting an occlusive on your skin. Okay. Meaning that the environment can't can't get to, your get skin. to it. Right. Exactly. It's like a protection. Whereas what we want to do is you want to exfoliate, get rid of those dead skin cells, then put as much hydration into your skin as possible, mm -hmm. and then apply your occlusive moisturizer to keep it in and stop the environment from okay, sucking so it out. After you've done all the prep and everything yes. that your skin needs, yes. the last step is the moisturizer that's because right. then that's the shield. That's right. Right, protecting yes. everything inside. And of course, if it's daytime, your very last step always is sunscreen. Sunscreen. Always. Okay. Okay. Mm. We'll leave that on. So how long are we leaving this on for? 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Yeah. See you back in 20 minutes. <laughs> Alright, so we've taken off the sheet mask. And like you said, there was a lot of essence still on there, right? So it would be good to just... Um, whatever's left on there actually just wipe it wipe your neck your um, decollete yes and your anyone arms, else your arms your legs, legs anywhere on the back of your hands mm. we're yes. sharing today yes. <laughs> <laughs> katrina doesn't like to be filmed no <laughs> she's being sneaky though <laughs> and always always bring everything down your neck okay always oh nothing i'm just um Oh my God. There's a lot of essence in that that particular mask. So I would just, at this stage, give yourself a nice little massage. Up. So just go along the jawline, up to the ear, and then down the lymph nodes. Okay, yeah. Yeah, you know that one. Yes. Yeah, that helps to sort of just deep up. Yeah. Thank you. Enjoy. You've got your lymph nodes back here. Mm. Give them a bit of a jiggle. Yeah. yeah. So you should use like two fingers. Yeah. And do it this way. Yes. Down. Nice. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. So that's settling in nicely. Yeah. You can feel that. You look ten years younger. Yeah. <laughs> More beautiful. <laughs> Again, just feel your face and feel how bouncy. There's a little bit of tack. Yes. But that will dry down. But have a feel at the... Oh, get... doesn't feel oily or anything. Mm. It's actually not oily. No, not at all. Because we're talking about hyd hydration. Hydration, exactly. Yes. So there's no yes. moisturizer. Yes. It's actually just hydrated. Yes. It feels like nothing. Mm. Like all those things, yeah. I've gone on my skin yeah. and I do not feel it. Because that's what I worry about, right? Mm. When when you say, you, you know, that all these steps that you used to use, and mm. I used to tell you, I'm like, mm. how, how do you use them all? Yeah. Um, and he said, yeah, but this is, you know, these are the steps I use. And your skin is always looking perfect. Mm. And now I understand yeah. that it's not like all these steps are not adding oil or moisture. It's actually just feeding your it's skin. It's feeding your skin, exactly. That's yeah. a great way of saying it. So you're feeding your skin. And at this point then, yeah. I mean, that's dried down really nicely. Mm. And depending on your skin type, mm -hmm. you may not want to put moisturizer on top mm -hmm. now. Yeah. Um, you could go in with, if you wanted to, just a very light primer through here. Mm -hmm. And then nothing else. Yeah. Do your makeup yeah. or leave your face. I mean, your skin looks lovely now. Put sunscreen on top. Mm -hmm. a bit of lip balm yeah you look beautiful there's no need to cover up your power skin gloss. yes yeah not power, power gloss. gloss yeah perfect because they're like a liquid lip balm yes um and yeah this is like really nice like i can really see the radiance and i'm not even right in front of the if i come in front of the light then you can see there you go then you can see how radiant that's looking yeah, it's really nice it just doesn't feel mm -hmm. heavy at all mm. i'm just like i can't believe it mm. i think you know like all these steps 
you know we're missing that we just mm. don't do in fear of feeling mm. heavy or, or or doing too much or feeling greasy yeah and it's really not like oh wow like and, i can just look, do that Let's um see. in terms of fitting it into your day yeah really um in the morning you know if i wanted to do all those steps 10 minutes if I wanted to add the fat, the you know sheet mask in, which is the twenty minute process, then I take it to a certain step. I put my sheet mask on. I'll have a coffee. You know, if you want to do your emails or whatnot at yeah. that time, yeah. you know, double up and get things done that way. Um, or you can do it at the back end of the day whilst right. you're sitting down watching your Netflix with your sheet mask on, which I often do. Um, it's a good reminder, honestly. Um, to do things like that and just yeah. have to take some time for yourself yeah. and especially now when everyone's sort of like home more as well exactly. it's a good time to be to take that time to actually give yourself a and little bit of TLC the thinking shouldn't be I don't have time for this I think the thinking should be is how can I make the time for make this? the time how can I make the time for me yes yeah. no, and it's a joy actually like yeah. I when you're doing all these I can feel it and I'm just mm. it feels nice mm, exactly and it's looking good and this is like no makeup obviously no makeup but mm. I mean it's really like making there's no filter on here mm. I'm just using my camera phone and it's just like it's bright like my skin is looking brighter already and that's you're just like one fresher. time exactly. fresher yeah I don't yeah. look I don't look like yeah. I've had surgery that's right <laughs> now and because we're just yeah. going to be extra special today yeah. Um, and we are inside with the air conditioning on. Yes. So I was talking about that occlusive barrier. So if you want your skin to sort of put something on top of it to seal everything we've done in, to yeah. seal on top of it, yeah. I'm taking the AHC Eye Cream for Face. It's, this is a great formulation. It's pretty, my, pretty much loaded with peptides um, to, again, nourish the skin, but it gives a nice, nice layer to protect your skin barrier as well. And it's not particularly heavy, but I find it really quite effective. So that's the one I'm using today. Okay. And again, I think I got that in mm. Guardian. I in think. Guardian. Okay. Yes, yes, so Guardian. Good. They're not very expensive. No. But they've, it's but you, I, because of your background, I know that you know all these ingredients. I, well. The first thing I do is take my old lady glasses out in <laughs> in the pharmacy or whatever store if I'm online and I just make sure that I tick the ingredients that I want mm -hmm. and because I'm you know a bit extra I make sure that I tick the ingredients that I don't want mm. in, a, in a product as well. Now you can feel that again there's a little bit of tack yes. but that will dry down but you can see it's how it's added just an extra glow factor to the face but it's not grease it's that really the difference between glow and grease yes oh god wow katrina this is amazing Re like my skin is bright it's gleaming i love it wow no and it does not feel greasy at mm, all exactly. it feels really light it just feels like a really light moisturizer yeah exactly it's really nice. Wow. I'm so happy. This is so nice. It feels great. Yeah, it feels very smooth. It feels very great. Plump. plump. Yeah. Yes. Plump is the word. Yes. Plump, yeah. It feels plump and yeah. um, healthy. It's just yes. got this very nice, healthy look. Yeah. Take this off here. Yeah. So, you know, we did that little bit of exfoliation with the glow tonic, and you can use any, you know, whatever yeah. suits you, whether you're a glycolic person, whether you're a polyhydroxy acid, whether you're lactic, whatever suits your skin, but just to exfoliate that touch and then to feed the skin, not just, um, not just lay a moisturizer on top of it, but right. actually feed the skin. Feeding the skin is yeah. the... Uh, that's the main thing yes. that we need to be taking away yeah. is that all these extra steps that we took, which you may like, some people may think that they're a little excessive, but now after going through the whole treatment and, and seeing exactly what you do, I understand. Yeah. I can understand that all these steps were feeding certain ingredients that my skin needed um, without adding any heaviness or oils or anything. And the oil or moisturizer was only put right at the end to just lock everything in right and just create that shield and the thing is you know with the products we've used today yeah. i haven't really used anything that's probably over 35 dollars at the most 
Um, so these are, I'm, I'm going to, to now. Fucking. All right, guys, you need to know this. So the the total cost of everything that I, Katrina just used on me today. Hold on, let me just do that. So guys, you've got to hear this. Uh, the cost of everything that Katrina used on me today is averaging around the $80 mark which is amazing for all these so i can count one two three four five six seven eight nine nine products oh sorry eight products mm -hmm. yep yeah. eight products we've used and that's like averaging ten ten bucks a product and it's and you're getting this amazing amazing and for product. instance something yeah. like that that yeah. whole bottle look i can't remember it was probably fifteen dollars or so for the whole bottle and that would probably last you between five six months wow five six months so that's the thing like so eighty dollars yeah and you've got products that could last you like three to five six months mm -hmm. so it's an amazing it's like a great investment i really hope um you guys try these products out i cannot recommend them enough because i've seen them on katrina now she's not letting me <laughs> <laughs> show us i but i kid you not i've always said to katrina the first day i met her i was like oh my god you just look amazing and katrina do you mind can do, can we uh, ask how old you are can oh, i say look i'm i'm old and proud now i just turned 56 on sunday <laughs> that she wants me to come in. there you go and her skin like i've got like honestly like i her skin is amazing like in real life as well and she's just so for me she's like my skincare guru here in Singapore so if I want anything if I'm looking for something I always ask Katrina and if she says oh Samina there's this product I'm like yeah just get it for me. <laughs> and I'll pay you like blindly trust her um and so I'm so so grateful that you came today and gave it's me a, a pleasure. pleasure session pleasure. um <laughs> such a nice gift and guys um if you want more details on the products I'll put a link and you guys can check it out and um, yeah, I'm urging Katrina to start her own blog. But she's, <laughs> she's not. <laughs> but anyway, if you want any, uh, if you ever want to reach out about skincare, then let me know, and I can see if I can get Katrina to help you or through me by you, whatever. So I just hope that this was helpful to you guys, and I'm really grateful um, for this treat. And um, yeah, feel good. <laughs> I can't wait till tomorrow because always the next yes. day you see the benefits, yes. right? Yes. Yes. So yeah. yes. All right, everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye.